Hey guys, what's going on? Um, today I'm going to be testing out this thing, this project by Nash Buhandis, I'm not sure how to pronounce his name, uh, called VK Doom. It is GC Doom, but with Vulcan actually done correct, well, from, from like the ground up, right? Because if you use um, GC Doom, it, it has Vulcan, but it's just kind of like a enhanced OpenGL, and it's, from what I understand, it, it, it's kind of like a wrapper, like if you ever played uh, Gears of War Ultimate Edition on, on, on PC, and it's like, oh, it's going to have uh, Dark Age 12, but like, it's it kind of sucked. It, it, it's kind of like that. Um, I'm not saying it sucks or anything, but like, there's more you could do with the um, wrapper with, 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 with the layer. So, uh, I'm going to be playing some Brutal Doom. Um, but what you have to understand is this is, this is like, absolutely not ready yet. Um, I... If anybody watched the uh, Nash and uh, Chilo stream for a uh, box of Doom, um, you'll know somebody asked him about it. It's like, oh, I'll talk about it when it's ready. So I, I just found this. Um, obviously, like, your mileage may vary. This is not a final product at all. Um, I did notice that the uh, voxels didn't work yet. Um, and I, I believe that because, like, the new version just came out of a uh, Doom. So um he's actually making this for his original game um which is based on a project he made in 10 days. He's like, "You know what? Let's just freaking make our own quick game um in 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 GZ Doom." So um yeah, I I got some uh I got some mods set up. You know, so uh, let's try it out. So first thing you'll notice once we load in is the menu interface is simplified. Thank God. <laughs> um, he, I, I, I'm not sure if he's waiting to port that in, but um, let's turn the sound down a little bit. That's better. So let's try. Hell on Earth. I played Hell on Earth a bunch of times. I should be able to do that easy. The one thing you might notice um, if you do try this is uh, like it runs really well. Now you'll notice from my if you've watched any of my other videos that this first area here, when I kill the first guy, it's going to be like, oh my god, I'm going to lag because I have auto auto save on, and uh, that generally makes uh, when I kill the first ten percent of the monsters is when it first hitches. Um, so you'll notice that it doesn't actually happen. And it is extremely God, that is fucking loud. Well, that's why. These are pretty fucking good monsters. Um, so as it stands right now, this is mostly for fooling around with. Um, maybe if he gets more attention, he'll be able to, you know, get some more support. Or I don't know what's gonna happen. Honestly, I just wanted to test it out. It's just kind of like. Wreck some shit, get some phases in, and uh, see how far we can push this thing. Obviously, if someone did a remaster or uh, oh shit, yeah. So this is my live reverb. Live reverb is fucking awesome. It's uh. Open AL soft. By the way, you should be watching this video with headphones. It doesn't really make much of a difference because you can't really hear what I'm playing. Alright. Yeah. This is really fucking well optimized. Do we want the armor? Yeah, I'll get the armor. I 
I gotta say, dude. Um, the combined app, the combined dodge roll on a uh, <laughs> Google Doom Platinum is it's, it's fucking awesome. Regardless of if you like the sprinting or not, I think it's good because Brutal Doom is honestly a little bit different from Doom. So I have a 280 Hertz monitor, 2080 Super, um, an i9 9900K F. Um, that's the one without the G with the Intel GPU inside. Uh, 3600. Megahertz uh, ran with cast 14 extremely latency. So I basically like maxed out this generation of hardware. And uh, even then, like GZ Doom would often um goes on Vulcan. For some reason OpenGL works a little bit better. I like OpenGL ES. It uh, turns off a lot of the um special effects, but it generally works faster. So if you find yourself gravitating towards OpenGL ES, you might like this ability because it does run really fucking well. Even when it's like, even when it's like nowhere near ready. Like this is, I'm not sure how ready it is. We say that at some point we're gonna get be able to get uh, fake ray tracing. Maybe even real ray tracing. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. There's the last one. Okay, I should be able to deal with that. have been buffed, haven't they? It definitely does feel more like a, a weapon sandbox. If you don't know, Project Brutality, i uh, sorry, <laughs> um, it's not Project Brutality. Rude and Platinum is like, uh, someone's personal fork It's trying to be more of a weapon sandbox, like, uh, like Halo. Ah, language. And uh, I say the early versions felt more like a little bit of sprinting, but now it feels really fucking cool. So you got the uh, plasma shells. Um, plasma shells can bounce back and hurt you, so I'll show them off. I'm gonna turn on um, auto reload. Get dragons wrapped around with the uh, super soccer. This is fucking baller. Oh, yeah. And this particular, um, this particular armor has a, uh, overshield.
Let me see. What do I have for the uh Fucking great. God! That is so fucking optimized. The water, too? Okay. God, this is so fucking sick. I mean, I do feel bad for covering this a little bit, because if I was the guy making this, I'm like, oh my god, you're already playing it. But honestly, dude, they did a really good job. I mean, even now. So, if you want to check it out yourself, go ahead and uh, visit the description, or just Google VK Dome. Just like you did. Um, signing off.